Hey guys, it's Amy and welcome to another episode inside of Amy Lee's Land of Love and tomorrow it's Valentine's Day, it's my favourite holiday, it's the day of love. So I thought we'd have a really fun episode today but let's start the episode as we always do and have a look around for my wonderful Minecraft family. Now where is Bert and Bertha today? Hey guys, where are you? Oh hey, I can see Bertha down here. Hey Bertha, how are you doing my darling? Bertha, look at me. No, Bertha, I I'm down here. Bertha, Bertha, look at me. Bertha, I I'm right here, honey. Look out there we go. Bertha, your eyes are shining like my lovely, chubby love, love petals. <laughs> Loves it. Now, where's Bert? Uh, Bert? Hey, where are you, buddy? Are you upstairs? Hey, Bert? You know, I don't think I've actually seen him this morning. Um, oh, there he is. Oh, Bert. Hi. Hi, Bert. Hi, it's me. It's Amy. Um, what you doing? Are <laughs> you looking for the block of the day? Which one is it today, but is it this one up here? Oh, I can see why you picked that one. It um, it really does stand out. <laughs> How funny, Big Iron Gooseberry. Now let's go and see the doggies and of course the kitty cats too. Good morning, everybody. Oh, good morning, doggies. How are you doing? Good morning, kitty cats. How are you guys doing? Have some fishy. There we go, Comet. There we go, lovely Saturn, and of course, little star there as well. And hello, doggies. Are you all ready for your breakfast? Are you guys hungry? I know just what you'd like. Potato? No? Are you sure? What about steak? <laughs> How about fish? No, okay, steak it is. <laughs> Loves it. There we go, lovely Lexi. We have Layla there. We have little Boomer. We have Mars. Over here we have lovely Max. We have little Luna. Over here we have Destiny. We have Sailor. And of course, Romeo. Loves it. Now, which doggy should we take with us today? Hmm. I'm just trying to think. You know what? I don't think we've had Luna very recently, so I really want to take Luna. You want to come with me? <laughs> Luna, I'm not teasing. Why don't you come with me today, Luna? Because you know what? I really miss having my hippie flower child dog with me. Now, why don't we go and say good morning to Mittens, Mr. Frost, and Blizzard. And wait, that's, that's Mr. Frost at the door. What are you doing at the door? <laughs> Why are you not Mitten? Mittens is there and Blizzard is in the corner. Okay, well, as long as you guys are happy and not causing... Oh, there he is. Hello, Mittens. How are you doing? Mittens, you can't escape today. I've got loads to do. I'm going to finish building the swimming pool. Come on, Luna. It's okay. He won't escape. He's going to be a good boy. Yeah, <laughs> loves it. So, yeah, today uh, we need to finish up building this swimming pool. And that that's if Luna's coming. Luna? Luna, are you coming, honey? Luna, come on, you silly doggy. Uh, so, yeah, can't wait to do that. And hey, Bertha, have a lovely day. Loves it. But first, of course, we are going to go and see Grandfather Oak and go down to the cute recruit patch. Grandfather Oak, hi, how are you doing today? You're looking spiffing, old chap. Can you please tell me another story, Grandfather Oak? Can you please tell me a story about a mouse who lives in the kitchen and and the mouse rides around on a little tiny bicycle and and the mouse is looking for a piece of cheese and and this cheese is filled with magic that will turn him into a magical fairy princess can you please tell me a story about that Grandfather Oak, that was an amazing story. <laughs> Loves it. Only people with special imaginations can hear Grandfather Oak's story. And luckily, Luna and I are two of them. If you did hear him, send me lots of fan art of the story you just heard to my Facebook or Twitter. Links are in the description. But anyway, let's get down to the cute recruit patch and see which cutie we are adding today. And of course, my cutie is adorable. The cutie we are adding is Megan. Yay, we are adding Megan because she's having this amazing picture. You can see it on screen right about now. How cute is that? I totally loved it and I love that Megan made a tiara. She looks just like me. That is awesome. So thank you very much Megan and welcome to the cute recruit patch. Wait, what was that? I'm sure, wait, what was that? There was lovely chubby love love petals? Well, where are they coming from? Um, it's it's raining flowers. I'm not complaining. Luna, that's not you. Wait, what is that? There, there, there's someone up there. Look it. Who is that? Wait a minute. Is that Cupid? Of course, it's Valentine's Day. It's Cupid. 
Cupid, you're so majestical. This is amazing. Cupid is in the land of love. It's like he belongs here. Look, he has wings and everything. Hi, Cupid. Hi. He has his bow. Cupid's bow. Oh, Luna, look it. Cupid is here. Oh, oh, I think we should go follow him. Don't you think, Luna? Let's go follow Cupid. Do you think he's here for, like, a reason? Like, like, what if, what if Prince Oliver is here? Hey, Cupid, do you know Prince Oliver? He is my one true love, and I miss him. Do you think he's here? Do you think it's, like, a surprise or something? Come on, Luna, keep up, buddy. Um, where are you taking us, Mr. Cupid, man? Uh, that's my house. Do you think Prince Oliver's in the house? Um, hey, Bert, hey, Bert, hey, Luna, come on. Good job, Luna, good job. Um, hey, right, you sit down there. Where, wait, what are you doing, Cupid? Hey, Cupid? Hey, um, this is Bert and this is Bertha. Um, but, but surely Prince Oliver must be here, right? I mean, it is Valentine's Day after all. Cupid? What is he doing? Hey, Cupid. Th that's, that's Bert. He's my own god. Wait, what are you, <gasps> Bert? Are you okay? Hey, hey, buddy, you okay? Oh, wait, no, 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 that's Bertha. Oh, no. Oh, what have you done, Cupid? Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, this is crazy. Cupid, what have you done? They're falling in love. Bird, what are you doing? Oh, wow. Okay, um... It kind of looks like that they're gonna kiss. This is so adorable, I cannot quite even. I've ever seen in the history of cuteness and I've seen lots of cute things <laughs> oh Cupid thank you for spreading lots of love in Amy's land of love that's amazing I cannot believe that that is so totally cute where are you going Cupid where are you going oh he must be off to spread more love on Valentine's Day well thank you for coming Cupid it was really awesome to meet you maybe next Valentine's Day then then maybe I get to see Prince Oliver again because I really miss him but have safe travels Cupid you what I'd quite like to be Cupid for a day. That'd be quite a fun job. Yeah. Hmm. I think I'd like to do that and spread more love and positivity. But anyway, oh, that is so cute. Oh, I've just had the best idea in the history of ideas. What if we had a wedding and Bert and Bertha could get married? Oh, okay, 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 okay. Wedding planner overdrive. Let's plan a wedding. <laughs> I've never planned a wedding before. I'm so excited. Okay, what do we need? Um. Hmm, I'm trying to think. We could do with some... None of that. Uh, oh, let's take some leaves and make like a nice archway or something. And then let's get a whole bunch of flowers to make it look pretty. Because, you know, weddings and flowers equals prettiness. Um, and then uh, let's grab some birch wood to make like a nice platform on the floor. And then uh, let's take some stairs because I got an idea in, in, in my imagination for those. Um, and then, hey, you guys are getting married. Okay, let's go out here and... And, oh, you know what? Behind the fountain or in front of the fountain would be the perfect place. Let's start doing that. I'm so excited. Can you tell? Yeah, <laughs> love it. Okay, let's put the city where I'm gonna stand. Um, actually, not there. Um, I think we should we should turn it around a little bit. And uh, let's go back a bit. Um, let me grab some of this wood and about here I think and then I can stand on this right and then I marry them and then if we get the jungle leaves and then we can make like an archway um, maybe no let's take that away maybe a little bit further there we go okay that's good and then the same on this side and then let's build this up a little bit it's gonna be tall enough for the big iron gooseberries to be able to fit under as we know they are humongous I cannot even the excitement is killing me and um, let's join that over over like this uh, I kind of like that there's a gap there let's take the, the other corner away there we go loves it and then let's get the flowers the fun stuff oh that looks really nice doesn't it oh I love it 
okay, let's put those away and get some of the um, yellow flowers and the tulips and stuff. And this is kind of like put those like all over and stuff. Oh, I'm so excited. I cannot even. All right, this is looking really, really cool. Um, and then um, what if we had, uh, we need a place for them to stand. So why don't we like make like a little platformy thing here and then they can stand on there. And then, uh, what else could we do? Um, oh, we need the aisle! We need the aisle! So they can walk down the aisle. That's it. Okay, so let's use this kind of wood and go all the way down. And then, yeah, they can walk along the aisle into holy matrimony. That is really, really cool! I like it muchly. Okay, um, hmm. What else could we do? I think we need a few more flowers. I don't think there's quite enough prettiness or cuteness. Uh, orange flowers are nice. Look at that. That really makes it come alive. <gasps> I'm so excited. Oh, that looks really, really neat. I like that muchly. Uh, of course, we need some of my lovely, jubbly love of petals. So we could line the aisle with my favorite flowers. There we go. Ah! <laughs> This is so exciting! Let's make it a little bit longer, just so we can have a nice long aisle, uh, like so. And, um, yeah, we're gonna need, um, a few more, uh, flowers going down here. There we go. It loves it. Oh, it's looking perfect! Look at it! The first wedding in Amy Lee's Land of Love. Ah, oh, I cannot even. Okay, so now let's get back. Oh, you know what we should do? We should get all the doggies down! And the doggies can, like, watch the wedding and everything! It's going to be so exciting. Come on, Luna, let's get everyone else. Guys, guys, guess what? There's a wedding to go to! Come on, Lexi! Come on, Sailor! Come on, everybody! We're gonna go downstairs and 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 we're gonna watch the wedding, and it's going to be beautiful, and you're gonna love it, and you cannot quite even. It's going to be amazing. Come on, guys! I'll see you, Iron Gooseberries, in a second. I'm gonna come back, and I'm just gonna see the dogs down, and well, I'm gonna see the guests down because they're guests of the wedding. Come on, gang! Look how cute they all are! Ah! Oh. <laughs> Bert are like, what's going on? Nothing. Come on, doggy crew. Right, okay, so we need to sit everyone down. Are you all here? It looks like you're all here. Um, I think you're all here. Um, <laughs> it gets really hard. This is why I don't take them all out at the same time, because it's really difficult to, like, control them. Wait, is that everyone? Where's Lexi? Uh, Lexi, that, that's Max. Are we missing somebody? Let's, where's Lexi? Um, maybe... Maybe she hasn't um, TP to us yet. Uh, shall I go back and get... Oh, I'm sure she'll turn up in a second. Okay, let's get you guys seated. Um, and we can have, like, some on one side and some on the other. Oh, look, look, Lexi's over there. Good job, Lexi. Okay, that's cool. So let's get, like, some of you on this side, the groom side, and then the others can go on the bride side, on Bertha's side. This is so exciting. Yeah, <laughs> we need to have a flower girl. Oh, I can be flower girl as well as the wedding maker person. What do you call a wedding maker person? The vicar person? That's what I want to do. I want to I wanna be the flower girl and I want to marry them too. It's going to be super fun. I'm so excited. Okay, uh, let's put some of this stuff away. Um, and then let's go back and if we grab Bert and take Bert to the wedding ceremony place And then we can come back and get Bertha and walk her down the aisle. Hey guys, this is so exciting I'm gonna go ahead and grab some of Bert's favorite um, block so that he will follow me and that will be really really cool <gasps> Guys, this is so exciting. You're getting married. You're growing up so fast. I'm not going to cry, okay? I promise myself I'm not going to cry. Okay, so Bert my darling I am going to take um, you down to the wedding ceremony, please. Uh, so what we need to do is I need to remove the top of this thing so you can actually, you know, like, get out of the building. Because otherwise you can't because you're just too big. Um, and then come on back. Just follow me. Amy has your favorite block. I have the block of the day, Bert. That's it. Nice and slow, Bert. You can do it. This is your big day, Bert. <laughs> yeah! I'm so excited. Come on in, Bert. That's it. Good. Boy, bird, who's a good iron golem? You're a good iron golem. You're a good egg. Come on then, Bert. He walks nice and slow. He's quite an old chap, you see, is Mr. Bert. I think he could be nervous as well. <laughs> Don't think he realized when he woke up this morning that today would be his wedding day. But it's so exciting. It's Valentine's. It's like the perfect Valentine's to get married on Valentine's. I cannot even. The excitement. We all know how much Amy loves romance and love. Right, love's it. Are you ready, dogs? This is so exciting. Right, Bert, what I'm going to have you do, okay, I'm going 
to have you sitting or standing um, at the top here like in normal marriages and I'm going to put your favorite block down here so that I know that you'll stay there. Okay, so you sit there and don't panic. Everything's going to be just fine and now I'm going to go and get the bride. I'm going to go and get the bride. I'm so excited. Let me get my flowers ready because then I get to be flower girl as well. Oh, I'm so excited. Bertha, hey Bertha, are you ready? Are you ready to get married? Everyone's out there waiting for you, Bertha. This is it. This is your special day. I'm so proud of you, Bertha. You're an amazing iron golem, and I love you. I'm so proud to be part of your special day. Come on then, Bertha. Let's start. Bert is waiting for you, Bertha. He's over there. Do you see him? Bert is over there waiting for you. <laughs> this is like the most romantic day in Amy Lee's Land of Love. This is going to go down in the books of romantic history. I'm not going to cry. Okay, I promised myself not to cry. I'm going to be good, okay? This is it, Bertha. This is it. Are you nervous? She doesn't look that nervous. I think she's been waiting for this day for a long time. I think secretly, Bert and Bertha have loved each other since the day they came together. I love it. Okay, are you ready, Bertha? This is it. This is your moment, Bertha. You are going to be married. Yeah, <laughs> loves it. Okay, okay. i got to do my flower girl duties, and then it's all on you, Bertha. beloved we are gathered here today to join in holy matrimony mr but whoa, whoa wait wait stop the music we haven't got any rings what are we gonna do What are you doing here? You have the diamond rings? Mittens! You saved the whole wedding! Good job, Mittens! I'm so proud of you! Now let's carry on this wedding! Dearly beloved, we are gathered here today to join Mr. Bert and Mrs. Bertha in holy matrimony. Now Mr. Bert, do you take Mrs. Bertha to be your lawfully wedded wife? And Mrs. Bertha, do you take Mr. Bert to be your lawfully wedded husband? Then with the power vested in me by the land of love, I now pronounce you husband Gollum and wife Gollum. You may now kiss the bride. Yay! <laughs> You're married! This is awesome! <laughs> Loves it. Have some lovely, jubbly, love, love petals. Yay! Congratulations, Bert, and congratulations, Bertha. And well done, Mittens. Oh, you know what you guys should do? You guys should go on a honeymoon. You guys should take a nice vacation together. What do you think? Just the two of you. I think that would be really awesome. So why don't you guys go ahead and do that and have a day off from the land of love. Bye, guys. Have a lovely time, okay? Spend lots of time together and send me a postcard wherever you go okay and i'll see you guys in a few weeks oh they look so romantic look at them they're just the cutest little things oh way to go it loves it and mittens mittens you saved the day yet again you're starting to be quite the little hero loves it anyway guys i really hope you enjoyed this video but it is the end now thank you guys so very much for watching i hope you have a wonderful valentine's day tell me all about it in the comments below bye guys i love you